So this video is slightly different to our normal stuff, but why not help people out? That's what we do here. So X, Twitter, the big social media is being banned and blocked in Brazil. So if you're a Brazilian user, this video will help you out. And we're going to tell you how you can still use it. Plus, for the rest of us, we all need to be aware of what is happening in the aspect this could happen anywhere. And this is a way we can get around anything. It's not down to other people or politicians or governments or lawyers or judges to block what you view on the Internet. You choose what you view on the Internet around the world. OK, if other countries are allowed to view it, then you should be allowed to view it and vice versa. But obviously they're your opinions. But I'm going to show you how this will work and how we can make X and Twitter work for you if you're in Brazil and take this on board from other countries. So if you've got sites which you're not able to access, this will help you as well. Brilliant. Before we do that, though, do remember to hit that follow button. We do bring you we're mainly streaming content here, streaming movies, TV shows, uh, fire sticks, all that sort of content. So if you're a new viewer here, thank you for dropping in. This will help you out. Hit that follow button. Subscribe. It's free. So what is going on? Musk's X banned in Brazil after disinformation round. So X, formerly Twitter, has been banned in Brazil after failing to meet a deadline set by a Supreme Court judge to name a new legal representative in the country. So the row began in April with the judge ordering the suspension of dozens of X accounts for allegedly spreading disinformation. Um, the social media network is said to be used by at least 10th of the nation's 200 million inhabitants. By Saturday morning, some users have reported access to the platform was no longer possible. So there's loads of it in there. I'm not going to go too much into it because it's not really for me to get involved too much into um, political sides of things. Um, and why this is happening, that's not my say. Obviously, different countries, people, what they're all doing, that's down to them. But as we all know, if you want to be using a platform like this, the simple option is always a private network. So virtual private networks, VPNs, will help you do this. For example, if I fire up a, a VPN, these are all the countries I can connect to. So I can connect to any of these countries and your device um, let me move my head. Sorry, I'm in the way there, aren't I? Your device will think you're in one of these countries. So when you access the internet, whether it's on your PC, your mobile phone, streaming device, whatever you use to access any form of internet, will think you're in that country. So you select one of these countries. Um, the one I'm showing you right now is IP Vanish. We are partnered with them, so we get a great price for you guys. OK, and I will link that underneath. They have one of the most servers around. There's 90 plus server locations. I'll link that directly underneath for you. So if you have a ac problem accessing any website, this will allow you to do it. Um, also has advanced encryption and they have no traffic logs. So no one will know what you are viewing online. OK, they've got 90 plus server locations, no tr data transfer caps. And the good thing about IP Vanish is you can use it on as many devices as you want. So you could even share it with family members if you really want to if you sign up to an account. That link is underneath for you as well. Another good one is NordVPN. We will link underneath as well. Great prices. You get a few extra months free high speed VPN. So if you're not getting the success you want from the first one, Nord is a good one. And finally, if you can't afford a VPN, there is a few options of free ones out there, but you have to be careful. Free VPNs can be risky because you don't know what they're doing with your data. The difference with award VPN as a free one, I'll link underneath as well. It gives you a six hour access pin, which you can renew as much as you want. And they make their money off of adverts on the websites. There's no login, no sign up. So no one would ever knew, even need to know or know you're using it because it's all free on there. And after all of that, if you do finally get onto your Twitter, your ex, don't forget to follow me, Doc Squiffy. I'm always here for you. I'm here to make sure you're getting the best out of your streaming and your Internet use and, you know, your privacy all in the same place. And don't let someone dictate what you can watch. Brilliant. So I've been Doc Squiffy. I'm going to call that one there. It's a real quick video from us. Because like I said, it's slightly different to what we would normally do. But enjoy that video, hopefully. Share it around. So if anyone needs any help, that video will help you. Install that. Follow those links underneath in the um, description, in the pinned comment. There we get your VPN. Then you'll be able to install it from all your app stores. Any troubles, do feel free to comment underneath. Brilliant. I've been Doc Squiffy. Hit that follow button for free. And I'll see you soon.